up? Hope you're all doing good. Today I said I will record a short, a short video in the car. Now that I have the opportunity, I just dropped off my daughter to tuition. So I have one hour. So I came by the beach over here. Uh, it's not the beach actually, the sea in Jufair. So I said I'll wait for it because her tuition is in Jufair. Uh, I want, just want to talk a little bit about just a small topic about um, why a lot of companies, they do mistakes when it comes to marketing. Why uh, I have noticed a lot of companies, especially startups, when they work with agencies, when they work with advertising agencies, or let's say not even advertising, companies that call themselves advertising, but they are actually printing company and they say, no, we can create for you a nice logo. We can create for you. So there's a sound out. There's an ice cream truck over there. We can create for you the logo. We can do this. We can do your social media account. But they are actually, their experience and the people who are working there, they are actually and they are a printing company and they are only have knowledge about printing the printing when i say either offset printing or digital printing banners roll-up stands and so on and so forth um now the biggest mistake i've seen that a lot of clients uh, do other than let's say vision mission the objective a tone of voice what is your direction what is your why you know keep this all aside but the main thing is main thing is is the target audience a lot of clients, they don't know who are their target audience. Let me give you an example. I had a meeting a, once, a while back uh, with a person who was into real estate business. So uh, that person wanted my advice, telling me that, you know, I want to know what I can do, how I can market my uh, real estate business company, so on and so forth, so on and so forth. The first question I asked that person was, do you know who are your target audience? Do you know who you are targeting? The, and that person was like, no, I don't know who are my target audience. No, actually, you know what? That person said, my target audience is everyone. And that, and that, and everyone tells me that, especially startup companies, especially people who are, you know, uh, people who don't know marketing, people don't understand branding and all. They will tell you, everyone is my client. You cannot have everyone as your client. Nobody's your client. Apple have specific clients. Uh, Microsoft has Windows, have specific people who love Windows will only buy uh, most, most uh, like the 90% majority who use Windows usually buy Lenovo, Dell, and so on and so forth. People who use iTunes will probably, or the probability of them is 90%, 80% who are going to buy Macintosh or the iPad product, for example. There are different target audience, totally different sector. So, for example, and that person's sector basically is real estate. Now, on real estate, that question I asked, who's, and that person was like, Everyone is my target audience because everyone wants a house. Everyone wants to live somewhere. Everyone, you cannot, it's wrong. You cannot have everyone. You cannot target everyone. For example, I asked that person, where do you live? That person told me I live in, that, uh, that person told me I live in Durrat al-Bahrain. Okay, great. You live in Durrat al-Bahrain. The question I asked that person, if you get a house on an apartment in Khamis, Jid house, for example, or let's say Salmabad, would you live? And that person was like, no. And I was like, why wouldn't you live in these places? Even if the rent is cheaper or so, Durat al-Bahrain is expensive. The houses are expensive over there. And if you get it rent, it's too expensive. Why? The person told me because the, the, the lifestyle. I like the people over there. So if you now, this this is the catch. I asked that person a question. Would you live in Jedhavs, Salmabad? No. Why Dora? Because of the lifestyle, because of the people, because there are a lot of expats. There are, lo there are a lot of uh, high, uh, via high end Bahraini, high income Bahrainis over there. So that's your target audience. You will not live in Jedhav because Jedhav, Salmabad, Khamis, it's not your target. You're not the target audience for them. It's a different people. Totally different people. So you need to understand as a person, as a business owner, as a startup, you need to understand who are your target audience, what are their interests, what do they love, who are their decision makers. For example, if you want to sell something, are the decision makers, uh, for example, like say Pampers, give an example, Pampers, who are the decision makers? Babies are the decision makers? No. Then people say, okay, but usually the father's purchase, the, part, the, the father is, is the one who go and purchases. No, the father doesn't decide if Pampers is the best, who, who decides the mother? Because if you look at their ads, Pampers ads, you will always see, see a baby crying and then the mother will come and take care of it and whatever. And where's the diaper, the Pampers? 
And all of a sudden, the mother's happy. She's smiling. She's feeling good about herself. She's happy that the baby is healthy. So the target audience are mothers. So you need to know also, even if your target audience is male, female, age, uh, age gender, uh, but then you need to take the next step. What are their interests? What do they love to do? What type of music they love? What type of lifestyle they they like? Are they are they do do they go they do they love to go in they like exercising? If they love exercising, they love jogging. That means we need to find them a place. For example, real estate. We need to find them a space that is calm and quiet, and there are long roads like roads that they can go and do jogging. For example, there is like a corner. There is a seaside. Uh, do they love yoga? That means the yoga people usually they like a place which are calm, uh, not congested. Why right? they, they they want to have a place a space that's that's soothing, that's relaxing. So when they wake up in the morning, there's a nice sunrise, there's a nice balcony, you know. And that's what I'm trying to say. So these are your target. You need to find out who are your target audience. Then, then you can market your product the right way. When I say market the product the right way, that means you know where where you can find them. Are you going to find them on social media? Is it Instagram? Is it Pinterest? Is it on LinkedIn? Is it on Facebook? Is it on, on where are they? Your target audience, where are they? Should I create a group? Should I create a seminar? Where are they? Where where can I find these target audience? The more you narrow it down, the more you understand better where you can find your target audience. Don't say my target is, is everyone because not everyone is going to purchase your product. Unless, unless your product is a medicine and your product is a medicine, for example, people who have diabetes, you have insulin, for example, and it's cheap and it's good quality, then Every person who has diabetes will come and purchase it from me because it's, it's, it's something that they need because their life depends on it, for example. But again, it's not everyone. It's only people who have diabetes. But people who are, have diabetes will be all your, all your target audience if your price is cheap. If your price is expensive, then people who have diabetes, only the rich people can pay it. Not the poor people cannot afford it. So understand what I'm trying to say? So always find your target audience. Make sure you narrow it down. Narrow it down always. Age gender where they live then you talk about okay we found what are the ages are they male or female where they do live what nationality are there now we understood this now you go to the next category what do they love what are their interests do they love music do they love playing guitar what type of food they love to eat are they healthy do they like diet are they vegans based on that you can narrow it down and even uh, go very direct Target it. Okay, everyone? Always think about target audience. Keep in mind, not everyone is to target an audience. No, no company in this world, again, I'm saying no company in this world, no company in this world can create a business that their target audience is everyone.